Hi guys, so I thought I would do my pop in the box unboxing for you. It arrived yesterday. Um, I've opened the box but I've not looked in it yet. Um, now I ordered two this time from pop in the box but then at the last minute uh, they had up a little button that meant you could add an extra pop to your mystery pops for I think it was 7 49 so I was like well it's too difficult to resist that so I clicked the button so I think that there is going to be three in here unless they've decided to ship one separately in the end anyway but um yeah let's have a look and see what we've got shall we let's see oh there's some happening. okay first pop okay again oh it's Ronald Weasley He's cool. I've been needing him. I did say last video actually that I needed him um, for part of my Potter collection. So now the only one I think I have left to get uh, is Snape. So hopefully that will happen at some point soon. But yeah, that's cool. Right, okay, let's move. Ooh, I'm running out of space everywhere in this room. It's a mess. Right, let's see what else we've got. Oh, come on. <laughs> Maybe they watched my last video. <clears throat> so we have Severus Snape, and that is Potter set complete. Although I did see, actually, that... Um, sorry, I've got... <clears throat> I did see that they are supposed to be releasing some more. Now, it's not, I don't think it's been 100% confirmed. And I don't even know what group I saw it on or what page. It was on Facebook somewhere. But it looked like it was fairly official. Um, that they're going to be releasing some more. So we're going to have Luna and Dobby and... Draco I think and a few others so that should be really awesome if they do do that I have high hopes so right assuming that there is another pop left in this box oh yeah there is another pop it is oh fear love it it's quite weird actually because I have probably got I don't know like I'd say at least 40 or 50 pops in my liked list on th on Pop in the Box that um, are common pops. Like I've got some ones like that are never going to happen because they're like exclusives from years ago but I just want to keep track of the fact that they're ones I do actually want to get at some point in the future if I can get them somewhere. Um, but I made a list of which three I thought I would get today and Fear was on there and I think I put Ron on there as well so not bad guesswork right? Um, so that's pretty cool. I like him a lot. Look, he's just so cute. Let me put a close up so you can see him. He's all scared. Oh, bless him. Um, so I have got sadness, I've got anger, and I've got fear. So just joy, disgust, and uh, bing bong to get now. Um, and to be honest, I'm probably going to hopefully get them quite soon because I do really think disgust is an awesome pop. She looks super cute. So. Yeah, I'm really chuffed about that. Thank you very much for popping the box. Um, now, before you go, if you are interested, I have a couple of other pops that I've ordered and I've not opened yet. So, excuse me, when I move those out of the way for the time being. Um, if you are, if that's all you cared about, thank you very much for watching. See you again soon. Uh, if you care about these, then I shall open them. Now, this one, I'm not sure what this one is. Um, it might be an unboxed pop that I've ordered. And if it isn't, then mystery. Let's see. Oh, I think it must, yes, it is an unboxed pop, and it was what I thought, it is um, Legolas. He's quite difficult to get a hold of, um, cheaply, because obviously he's been vaulted now, um, and I just I just really wanted him, to be honest. Um, and so I got an unboxed work one, much cheaper than obviously getting the box one. Um, I think I paid, well actually only, I think because he's got a couple of little marks on him, he's not perfect. Um, and because he's out of the box, I think I paid like £12, £13, including postage or something crazy. So, yeah, I am really chuffed with that. I mean, there is a couple of little, I don't know if I can get him close enough for you to see in focus. Yeah, there's a little like blowout on his eye a little bit, but it's really not that bad. He's got a couple of marks on his hair. But to be honest, for the price that I've paid for him, I'm, I'm really happy with that. So, that's cool. That's my first um, Lord of the Rings pop. Hopefully, not my last. I'd really like to win. Um, a Bilbo um, and a hatted Gandalf and a Gollum. And I do like Harry Al as well. They're all cute. And Thorin, actually, Thorin's really, he, he's a really good pop. Um, he, he made a far better pop than I had realised he was going to. But oh, now we need dwarfs. Why have they never done all the dwarfs? Outrage. 
Anyway, um, I've got one more to open. I know what this one is because it is from Pop Culture and because it's customs on it, they have to actually write on there what it is. And it is my 12th Doctor with a spoon. Um, I won him a little while ago on a, on a raffle group. Um, I've been waiting for him to arrive and now he has. He's really cool. I do like him. Um, yeah, look. So cute. And I also ordered um, recently um, the 10th Doctor in a spacesuit. Now I don't know whether Pop Culture or Forbidden Planet are actually going to get them in stock or not. They've put them up on the website, let you buy them, but obviously if they don't get sent the stock then they're not going to be able to fulfil the orders. But um, I put one an order in on Pop Culture for me and then saw that they were on Forbidden Planet so I put an order in for my sister because it was, I think they went up at like I don't know, like two or three in the morning. And so I couldn't get hold of her. I might have been a little bit earlier than that, but I couldn't get hold of her, so I just thought, oh, I'll put the order in. So we'll see. If only the Forbidden Planet one comes in, let you know it's still mine. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's cool. I'm liking that, it's really sweet. So yeah, there we go. Thanks for that pop culture. I hadn't realized how cheap they were. I'd always thought they'd be more expensive because you've obviously got to pay to get them shipped from Australia, which is where they're based. Uh, in a town called Geelong, which I have actually been to, strangely enough. But um, yeah, I thought it'd be quite expensive, but it worked out about £17, and that's actually, a, like, because it's a uh, New York Comic Con exclusive, it's actually a more expensive pop than their standard ones. So I think a normal pop works out about 15, 12, uh, no, 15, 12, what? 14 or £15. Pounds. So it's not bad, really, when you consider that some of them are quite difficult to get hold of in this country. So. Yeah, like this one is an exclusive one. I don't know if, um, yeah, it's the, with the spoon from the uh, Robin of Sherwood episode. So that's really cool. Anyway, um, thank you for watching. Take care and I will see you soon. Bye for now.